I come from a county that has Philadelphia County and Delaware County, which has a significant representation of Latino populations. But more importantly, I come from a family of struggle, a history of sometimes being denied rights in a country that says it embraces immigrants and people of all backgrounds. I come from a family that has a history of at moments being denied access and opportunity to what all Americans felt to be basic freedoms and considerations. And this particular piece of legislation not only represents the finest and highest goals within this country, it also represents a vision of what this country can, should, and will be. That means a return to its basic roots of accepting all of us, even if we come from a foreign land, with a basic understanding. And that is if you work hard, wake up every day, take care of your family, don't break the law, participate in civic responsibilities, are proud to be an American, then you too will be accepted by this country, and not only accepted by this country, but embraced by this country. And to be embraced means that basic institutions, such as educational institutions, would allow you to participate at its highest and fullest level. You will hear stories today of young people who have fought against all those odds that I've described, and in spite of that, in spite of limited perspectives on occasions, bullying, any appropriate comments, people trying to deny them access to institutions, in spite of all that, they've excelled. They've excelled because this grand experiment of America still works, and that they believe in this country and their parents believe in this country. And what they simply want is fair access to a higher goal that their parents probably may not ever be able to achieve, and that is one to have a college or graduate degree. And they would love to do it in Pennsylvania. And we would love to have them as Pennsylvanians. Because all documents show that if they graduate from, the, from a, a Pennsylvania school, if they settle in Pennsylvania, then not only will they work in Pennsylvania, but they will be probably one of the greatest contributors to the revenue stream that we direly need in this Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. So I'm proud of the work that Senator Smuckler, Senator Swank, and others are doing. But well, I'm most proud of the participants who are asking for this opportunity. And it's my expectation that through Senator Smuckler's leadership, through the governor's signature, that they one day will soon have the opportunity to attend any institution in Pennsylvania that they would like and enjoy. God bless you.